Hello, let's talk about something very, very important. I understand that many United fans are frustrated, are angry, some are even genuinely angry. So many times they see any news concerning United about being linked to any player, they get angry, they get frustrated that it's always in discussions, always close, always talks, blah, blah, blah. We're always interested, but I haven't seen anybody yet. Honestly, I believe, I thought that by the first week of July, which is this week, would have signed someone. Today is Friday, but I haven't seen anybody. But guess what? This week we have had major updates um, in terms of the backroom staff and in the structure of the club. This week we got the Nashworth officially signing for the club. This week we have got um, our head of recruitment, Christopher Vivio, coming in. This week they had new contract um, extension was officially announced. This week also we'll, I expect something today or tomorrow concerning with Van Steroy and Rene Hake coming to the club officially. And this week also we had an update concerning United signing a new um, goalkeeper, uh, man, a goalkeeper coach coming in from Burnley, but he's going to Ajax, but we're going to pay a, comp a competition to Ajax to get him in. So that's almost one to f five new activities that happened this week. And it makes sense because the, the director of football is here. The person in charge of signing players is coming officially this week. The person in charge of recruitment also came in this week. So it makes sense that this week was also for the backroom staff, for the structure to get done. And now that it is done, we would expect that from next week, everything is going to go on really fast. And that's the truth. Because what, do you, what, what do you expect? We didn't have a director of football officially before. Our head of recruitment wasn't in before. But now those two important officials are in. What does that mean? Only means we, only, we can only go up from here. Also means that signings will be done. But you just have to have patience. Patience. And for the players that were advanced in, in negotiations with them, that is players like Ugate, um, Zexi, um, the Leeds, they are all in international, playing for their international, um, for their club, for their countries rather. They are all on international duty. And for Zexi especially, he doesn't want to finalize anything until after the Euros. For the Leeds, he has given United, um, he has given his, um, United his priority, attention, and um, even if we get a year we go on all those deals, it won't be official until after the international break. So I guess I understand why things are a bit slow, um, but I promise you that after the Euro, things will get a lot faster. We are, talking, we are speaking to multiple players at once, multiple clubs at once, multiple agents at once. So that just means that once the international break is gone, we see everything going coming in really fast. And the most important thing for you to remember is our director of football and our head of recruitment, recruitment are just coming in officially into the job so now it is time for everything to move on from there some players are still on holiday um the international break is still on so i don't yes really, i didn't really expect anything except for missing greenwood and didn't sancho especially missing greenwood i expected missing greenwood to have left by now but we have precision training starting on monday and he's still here but greenwood is not going to be part of that precision training i doubt even if sancho also is going to be part of that precision training but let's just have patience Let's give them the benefit of a doubt. We have had a lot of things come. Even 250 staffs were sacked this week. So a lot of things happened this week. Let's look at how things will develop next week. Today and tomorrow, maybe Netherlands might be out of the Euros. Maybe England might be out of the Euros. We have more players coming back, going on holiday. But the, the, as the Euros progresses and ends next week, we'll have a chance to sign, to talk about um, more signings because more players are back from international break and can now discuss about their future. So just patience, patience, please. Let's just wait and see what happens.